News Force Greg Circle joining us live in Manhasset this afternoon with uh, one nurse's story. Greg. Actually, Stefan, it's a doctor's story, and her story is personal and very emotional. She's treating some of the most serious patients, COVID-19 patients, here at North Shore University Hospital, and she describes the last 10 days as among the saddest and most harrowing of her entire career. Back for another shift um, at work. Dr. Evelina Graver documented parts of her day for us. She calls these days heart-wrenching. 12 to 16 hours inside a COVID-19 unit at North Shore University Hospital. Every one of her patients seriously ill and on a ventilator. You walk in and it's, it's hard for me to say, but you can actually smell fear. You smell death. Walking into the hospital, um, very different feel at this period of time. That different feeling, she says, is one of helplessness. There's little she and her colleagues can do for the patients on their unit. Half are well below the age of 60, people who just days ago had no health issues. The real picture is that the disease is way more severe than anybody could actually imagine. I cry. I think that's okay to actually say the fact that I do allow myself to, at a certain point, feel what this actually means. Thinking of her 12-year-old daughter helps her get through the day, she says, but it also weighs heavily on her mind. There's a fine line where you want to be able to put your life on the line and protect, but at the same time knowing that what you could be doing inside, you're bringing home with you and can infect your loved ones. I have my headgear on, I have my goggles on, I have the mask. Like many on the front lines, Dr. Graver says PPE is running short. She rewears masks and goggles that normally would be thrown away. There's no other choice. Earlier this week, Dr. Graver heard neighbors clapping at 7 o'clock, not realizing until her daughter explained that the cheers were for medical staff like her. I stopped in my tracks and I started to cry. I think all of that emotion that pent up in the, within the last 10 days that I've been in this hospital, I released right there. Now I'm about to walk into the unit. Be safe, everyone. Now, Dr. Graver wasn't able to take video on her unit, but she tells me if we could see what she's been seeing every day, no one would ever leave their home. We're live in Manhasset. Greg Sergal, News 4 New York.